Porsche Panamera Old vs. New, Styling. The old model was frequently criticized for looking a little dumpy from some angles. Porsche designers have looked to address this with a shape which, although instantly familiar, appears much more pleasing on the eye than before. Not that you'd necessarily notice that at first glance, though, since the styling is admittedly a complete evolution. Up front, the 2024 Porsche Panamera gets a new bumper design as well as revised, sharper, matrix, LED headlights with four distinct daytime running lights on each side, much like the new Cayenne. The 2024 Porsche Panamera measures 5,052 mm in length, 5,202 mm for the executive version, 1,937 mm in width, and 1,423 mm in height, 1,428 mm for the executive, while wheelbase is yet to be disclosed. Its dimensions are similar to before, just 3 mm longer than its predecessor. The integration of the electric motor into the redesigned 8-speed PDK dual-clutch gearbox contributes to weight savings, optimizing the electric drive unit's heat balance. The hybrid model boasts an electric range of up to 91 km in the combined WLTP cycle, complemented by a 2-hour and 39-minute charging time with the new 11 kW onboard AC charger. The new lighting arrangement sits just below an electrically operated rear spoiler which raises at speed for added stability. In the case of the top-spec turbo model, the three-piece design divides and opens outwards as it rises in a gloriously over-engineered piece of design. At the front, the face remains similar to before, but a refreshed bumper design, LED headlights and a lower, longer bonnet line all help to deliver subtle improvements. The new car has grown subtly in every dimension, measuring 34 mm longer, 6 mm wider and 5 mm taller than before. The wheelbase has also stretched by 30 mm, with the front axle nudged closer to the front of the car for a sportier stance. The car sits on 19 or 20-inch alloy wheels depending on spec. Massive 21-inch wheels are optional. Porsche Panamera Old vs. New, Interior. Though the theme of a low-slung cabin complete with a high central transmission tunnel remains, the new Panamera's interior features a vast reduction in the number of physical buttons to offer occupants a much more contemporary appearance. A tablet PC-like display in the center of the dash measures 12.3 inches, and can be customized to the driver and front passenger's tastes. Surrounding the gear selector are a range of touch-sensitive controls which can, among other functions, open and close the dashboard air vents. Directly ahead of the driver are two 7-inch displays mounted either side of a centrally mounted analog rev counter. Apple CarPlay is standard, and cabin comfort can be improved further thanks to an optional four-zone climate control system. Interior space is set to improve courtesy of the longer wheelbase, as has boot volume. A 495-liter volume is up 50 liters on the old car. Split-folding rear seats allow that figure to increase to 1,304 liters if needed. Porsche Panamera Old vs. New, Driving. The second-gen Panamera rides on a new platform, which is also likely be shared with future Bentley models. This new chassis, combined with lightweight aluminium body panels means that, despite the increase in size and equipment levels, the new Panamera is expected to weigh pretty much the same as the original. In order to make the Panamera one of the sharpest handling sports saloons on the market, Porsche has thrown all of its tried and tested acronyms at the latest car. PASM, PDCC Sport and PTV may all seem like jargon to the uninitiated, but respectively allow the driver to alter suspension response, improve cornering stability and increase overall grip. All systems are tied together by what Porsche calls 4D chassis control, which optimizes each of these settings in real. Also standard is the dual-chamber two-valve air suspension with Porsche Active Suspension Management PASM, offering a broad spectrum between comfort and sportiness. Optionally, all wheel steering enhances the car's handling, while Porsche Active Ride Active Suspension, 
available for e-hybrid models, is said to offer an unprecedented balance between driving comfort and dynamics. Porsche Panamera Old vs. New Engines The latest Panamera ditches the naturally aspirated engines of old in favor of a fully twin-turbocharged petrol and diesel lineup. The new entry point to the range is the 4S. Powered by a 3.0-liter V6, it offers up 434 horsepower and 406 pound-feet of torque 20 horsepower and 22 pound-feet up from the first general car. The newly fettled turbo, meanwhile, gains a hefty 30 horsepower and 52 pound-feet over the outgoing model. The 542 horsepower V8 Monster now fires itself to 62 miles per hour from rest in as little as 3.6 seconds and on to a 190 miles per hour top speed. Driver assistance systems include an active speed assistant that interacts with traffic signs, preventing the vehicle from exceeding speed limits automatically.